welcome back to a brand new video and as I promised I was going to analyze a chess game with the fishing pole trap and that's what I'm going to show you guys today. So I'm white so might as well start the game and I move my pawn to e4, he matches with mine at e5 and I attack his pawn with my knight at f3, he protects his pawn, his knight c6, I move my knight to c3 protecting mine in case he's going to attack it in, in, on his next move. He did, but that's probably just developing his pieces. Now, I move my bishop to c4. And he just gave me an almost free pawn at d5. I take it with my bishop. He takes with his knight. And I take with my knight. Right now, I'm up a pawn. And let's see what's next. So, he moves his bishop he moves his bishop to e6. I don't want to lose the knight and lose pawn structure in the center. So I move my knight back to c3. Then he once again attacks my knight with a bishop again. And that doesn't really bother me. And I move my pawn to d3. Then he castles, which is a perfect time to execute the fishing pole trap. So to do it, you have to move your knight to g5. Then you want to hope that he's going to attack your knight. And just as I was saying, he did attack my knight. And then you want to protect your knight. It's not losing your knight. It's not for free. It's all to do with the trap. So you want him to take as well. And then you take his pawn. Soon enough, he's going to play a move like f6. Then you're going to want to push your pawn to g6. Right now, his king's kind of trapped in a mating net. There's not much he can do about it. So he pushes his pawn to f5. That doesn't bother me. I move my queen to h5. Really now, he is kind of forced to resign. So he didn't resign. He took my knight first. And when I took his bishop, that ultimately forced him to resign. He has no checks. There's no chance for him to save the checkmate. In on, He has to play. And my next move will obviously be queen to h7 or h8 checkmate. Unless he moves his rook. But then again, I just got a h8. So if you guys did like that fishing pole trap, make sure to like and subscribe. And if you do... And if you are more in interested in some traps, subscribe so then you can see some other traps that I pulled on other people like the legal trap or a trap really similar to this fishing pole trap. Although I did sacrifice a bishop. Anyways guys, that's where I'm going to close off today's video. I hope you guys all enjoyed and I'll see you guys soon.